Right now at five, a 16 year old is dead after a police chase from Morrisville to Durham ended with a crash. Sky five flew over the scene this morning on South Miami Boulevard. An officer involved in the chase is on administrative leave. That chase started after an armed robbery and carjacking in Morrisville. The SUV crashed around 440 this morning in a field. The teenager was thrown from that car and pronounced dead at the scene. WRL's Aaron Thomas is live right now in Morrisville. And Aaron, we know there are still suspects connected to this chase on the run. Yeah, that's correct, Deborah. In fact, we just finished speaking with uh, Morrisville Police Chief uh, Peter Costa just within the past hour here. He says at this point, all we know is that there are four men involved in this case that are still on the run right now. Sky 5 captured the visuals of this aftermath of the crash from this morning. It was a 16-year-old boy who was thrown from this mangled car that you see, and he died from his injuries. Morrisville police officers, they chased the car because of an armed robbery and a carjacking at about 2.23 this morning, about 10 minutes later from that time, an officer spotted the stolen BMW SUV on Chapel Hill Road. The one officer began to chase the car but lost sight around Chapel Hill and Page Roads headed towards Durham. Investigators believe the crash is linked to the car chase from Morrisville. Occasionally we have these types of, uh, these types of crimes. Um, it is uncharacteristic for our town uh, that our officers are prepared to, to respond to these types of calls. So right now we are working to learn the identity of that 16 year old boy who has no ties to this crime at all and sadly lost his life in this crash. We'll check back in on WRL News at 7 as we go head to the area where this armed robbery and carjacking took place. Aaron Thomas, WRL News, live in Morrisville.